Cax and I have signed up for the Shores of Tripoli 2022 Online Tournament of Champions. How do we do? Let's find out here today on Legendary Tactics. All right, so this is game one of the Shores of Tripoli tournament that we have found ourselves into. Yeah, and it was a, it's been a lot of fun early early phases, but really enjoying it so far. So, so this is uh, your first game as as Tripoli. I know we played a game last week just uh, to re- refamiliarize. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. It was a, so this is this is my was the first uh, real kind of thrown into the fire here by uh, you know. Yeah. By, for, at least it was Tripoli was the, the side I played against you, so that was a good uh, <laughs> yeah a good brush up. So, so we got the American going first here. And we're just going to take a look at what they do. They decided to play naval yeah, it movement. It looks like they discard. Yeah, they played naval movement, and they moved uh, <clears throat> one of the one of their frigates went into the patrol zone around uh, Gibraltar, Gibraltar there, to yeah. hinder your corsairs from uh, moving to Tripoli, and then they also are blocking your piracy in Tripoli. And as I well, seem to so. recall that was one strategy you said: get in, play right away, get over to. Uh, get over to AAA. yeah it's not a bad idea yeah and so your hand here you've got uh um yeah so you have guns of Tripoli is not useful yet um but the other ones are well, well i've got yeah, uh, you, you got i could drop some troops in dern if i want to and i have yeah. um, i have some raid options but i don't really have any i got you don't those. have the allies yet yeah. though right yeah, i did the so, allies yeah and so, i do have yeah, the uh the great supplies. opening hand to be honest sorry it's not really that great an opening. No, hand. no, I do have this one here with the I can move the frigate out of the patrol zone, so I can get. Yeah, that one's really one annoying because you can say free up Gibraltar, uh, or uh, or just weaken uh, the patrol zone around Tripoli, which is what I like to use it for. But and and they can move it back, but it costs them a turn. Yes. Right? So if they weren't planning on moving their ship, then. It's a good one. So, so what end? What was your play? What did you end up uh, doing? I went, oh, you played. Oh, you played storms. Actually, I went Sorry with you... uh, yeah storms. So I yes, selected so... the patrol zone and uh, tried. And to... you missed. And I you missed. missed the roll. Yes. So then summer came along, and uh, U.S. built a gunboat in Malta with a discard. So right, discarded a naval movement, yep. and you built some extra troops in Dern. So that's fine. Yep. Kind of playing the waiting game, both of you. Exactly. And then in the fall, they uh, played another, discarded diff- another card yes, uh, to build, build a gunboat gun in boat. Malta. And you played U.S. Supplies uh, Run Low. Yeah, so, uh, so I get you to moved move... the frigate from Tripoli. So you didn't use Mered Reyes uh, Breaks Out, and that may be because you're just newer to the game. Yes, um, yeah. But to get those Corsairs from... Uh, Gibraltar. That was one um, I was looking at uh, after the fact. I thought, oh, probably a misplay there. I should have probably. Yeah. Well, yes and no. I mean, you do have to, in this case, with the frigate in Gibraltar, you're going to have to run that gauntlet. So right. When, when the frigate is a bit of a there. risk. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And so, so now <laughs> we move on to. Spring. Spring of 1802. And, uh, yeah, just, so the next year. Yeah. So uh, let's take a quick, uh, uh, we'll take a little glance through here. The, uh, the cards yes so you got um troops to benghazi is fine um tripoli attacks probably a bit early for that although you know what you could actually use that to strike at that oh what was a single frigate i was gonna say yeah um and potentially sink it Uh, morocco declares war that is one that is uh useful to you Um, oh yeah you don't have the and even even the uh the corsairs (laughs) get the uh Get yes, more that's a great one. Down. I also have Tunis, which is great. That... No, but oh yes, that's right, Tunis, and you have the raid card from that. So yeah, um, got some good. Yeah, so which one? Good which options one did here you end this, up this round? Discarding. Maybe click the single arrow. Okay, sure. Yeah, yeah. Discarded there. So, oh, okay. So the U.S. You discarded. Uh, he played. Uh, he placed two frigates on the following year turn track. So the Congress. Okay, so that yeah. So he, uh, this is skipping past the discard there so uh or maybe actually you may not have had a discard actually because uh I th- you may not have needed to so yeah so they uh, add the frigates to the following year yeah and uh, that's that's uh something to 
pay attention to? And then what did what was your response to that? Well, I thought we maybe we take a quick peek at, at the U.S. hand. Uh, yes, since we're, sure. we're we're the observers here, we may as well see what yes. what the uh, U.S. was playing with real quick, if you don't mind. No, uh, that's take, fine. Take a quick peek here. So he, he had assault on Tripoli. Yep, which isn't useful at all for him at this. A couple stage. naval naval movement cards, <clears throat> which are good. Handy yeah. tribute paid. That can neutralize an ally, so that's not good for just for yet. But that, uh, yeah, with what I have, that could be a problem down the road for me, <laughs> unbeknownst yes. to me. Uh, yes. Lieutenant Strett in <clears throat> pursuit. Yeah, that one's a good one if you uh, are, have a good uh, odds of sinking some corsairs. That can be a pretty good. Yeah, and then Preble's boys card. take aim. Yeah, it's situationally useful. And Lieutenant O'Bannon. Leads not the useful yet. Okay, not useful so until eighteen oh four at the least. Seems like he's got a bit of a mishmash there then of, of yeah. value versus. Not an amazing hand. All right, so let's see sure. what uh, what I end up going with here. So I got with, I went the with the corsairs. corsairs. I wanted to uh, kind of I I kind of was hoping he would bring his frigates over <clears throat> so that I could get yes. my two corsairs over. Yeah, uh, without without a problem. So I was trying to represent yeah. more more strength here. Yeah, sometimes you got to play the waiting game. I mean, for him to have that frigate sitting in Gibraltar is a, that's a, <laughs> it's a bit of <laughs> a tie a up, problem. right? Yeah, it's tied up, and you look at all those corsairs you have ready to, to sail from Tripoli, right? So yeah. that's a. Okay, so the so. next one here, <clears throat> we're gonna go to. He's gonna bring. Oh, he brought over. Oh, he moves two frigates, so he's probably. Oh, interesting. He just moved one of them. So he, he left, left one there patrolling. And he, yep, yep. yep. Uh, meanwhile, I played Morocco Declares War, and I got some, Set up, some uh, Corsairs Tangier. and Tangier. Yeah. I, I'm actually yep. trying to do the power play with the uh, the Yusef card yes, here. Yes, Yusuf Karmanli. Yes, Yusuf. and that's a good good idea early on. Like, well, anytime you can pull it off, it's a good idea. Yeah, so. yeah. So well, let's, uh, see how, let's see how uh, U.S. played uh, back. Here. Tribute paid. There it is. Paid, it didn't so take long. He cancels your... Uh, so he Your moved in the there. frigate. But now that does now, open up Gibraltar for me. Does open up Gibraltar. Uh, but I really wanted to get Tunis in. <laughs> no, okay, so that's fine. That's fine. That's uh, uh, So I played uh, Tunis Declares War. So now there's... Because I was really looking. I was really kind of um, tunnel visioned on that uh, um, Yusuf. Yusuf, Yusuf, I Kirk. think, still could make sense here because you do have a lot of, uh, a lot of uh, Corsairs to do some piracy. And that could be a... a Big game changer. So he discar discarded to move two frigates. Yep. And where did he go to? So he's moving. He's moving uh, to Tunis. To, oh, he's blockading you in Tunis. Tunis. He's getting nervous. And I went and with went I went with, with Yusuf. Yusuf. Yes, Yusuf. So let's Karamani. see how well we did here. One and a six. So he, he knocked me for one. Yep. And, and I, I you did. Got, you score got one, one merchant gold. ship. So that's one coin. Perfect. And he took me for two corsairs there, and I ended yeah. up with. Uh, three. Uh, was it three four? coins? No. Oh, yeah. Three, no. Three but you ships. got grand total of four for that raid. Right. So. That's what it was. Uh, that's yeah. okay. It puts the pressure on, especially. I mean, we're only in eighteen oh three, just at the very beginning. So there's a lot of pressure. Yeah. Yeah. So we. Yeah. We, so now that there's a discard that you have to do. So. Yeah. So now I was looking at which one to uh, to drop here. So. Yeah. It's amazing how uh, how. Um, the cards like Raid from Tunis feels so much less when there's there's two Corsairs there instead of three. I don't know why. It's such a... A lot know, more it's daunting, not, it's not eh? a massive difference, but yeah. So, yeah. Indeed. So, so you, we got rid of the... Th we, I, I just... Uh, yeah, we discarded three. Let's see if the American... Oh, looks like the American is at the right. Oh, and Corsairs confiscated. That's not good for you... Uh, Right in okay yeah in Gibraltar that event normally normally is only good in eighteen oh one but um, because you still have corsairs there but I haven't moved mine yet it. which was a, yeah a bit of yeah. a problem yeah so well, and he has three more frigates uh, as well is coming in yeah so. so things are looking a little bit tight right now <laughs> but his his cards are honestly not that am amazing you don't have a a frigate in Tripoli um, there's no land battle anytime soon. Um, I mean, Hem, Hem, yeah, Hamnet's armies. Hamnet's army can't be formed can't be until next yeah. year. So it's four turns. So he, yeah, he doesn't have a great hand actually. Yeah, <clears throat> they'll be building some gunboats and moving some. So what I ended around. up keeping was uh, the pirate raid from <clears throat> Tunis times two. 
Uh, yes. And uh, more uh, Tripoli uh, infantry yep. in the city. Yeah. And you have Algiers now as an ally. So that. Plays Algier Corsairs, yes. So. That's good. So, yeah. I'm looking to sort of uh, keep along the raiding route if I hopefully can yes. here. We'll see, see what happens. Yeah, I'm, see, he hasn't played his Swig Swedish frigates yet, which is, to me, a, a big waste. So he played naval movement to stir it off the hop here. He, he wants to get those ships over where they... Yeah, he wants to block, lock down Tripoli and perhaps Tunis as well. Oh, and he oh actually... he's going to go all in on Tunis. He's going to try and just take you out. Interesting. Yeah, that's a pretty good move, actually. Two he's hits. Got a lot. Yeah, he's, he's sunk. Took me out of Tunis. He sunk you there. So that's not a bad way. It's a, a bit of, um, you know, uh, going, uh, <laughs> it's, it's one of those things where you're using just a show of force to. So I had decided to go with the Philadelphia him. runs a grand. I, I wanted to try and tackle at least, uh, one of his frigates. Nice. Uh, and rolled a five. So captured. Nice. That so is that's... great. Now, little do you know <laughs> that he has the, uh, the counter to that. If you go to the United States hand. And take a look. He's got burn the Philadelphia. Ah, <laughs> so, that's right. He does that's too. That's a perfect one. <clears throat> but oh. he's uh, he's discarding instead. Interestingly, to discard, discard uh, to move, move two frigates, frigates and load up. And yeah. he's gonna and he's gonna do some shore bombardment there. Undern, yeah, yeah, and, and uh, missed, missed. I'll take that. Yeah. And then I went into Algiers with uh, Algiers declare of war. So I want to keep some pressure perfect. on. Yeah. Even though I don't have any Algiers rating cards, I wanted to represent and, and have him thinking about it. So yeah, uh, and he played Corsairs Confiscated. Finally, and so, I, I should have yeah. acted on that one quicker. I, <clears throat> yes, I should have yes. definitely. That was a misplay. Yeah, uh, but in the meantime, okay. I, I'm stacking up uh, Tripoli here. Move some troops yeah. to Tripoli. And again, like that's not a, a a bad move. I mean, it's it's a long term play. Like you're basically basically gearing up for the last battle of the game. <laughs> yeah, uh, but. Yeah. yeah. So now he's going to blockade Algiers. Maybe go in for Alexandria. Oh, so there's, yeah, so that's setting up Hammett's army. Um, now that doesn't happen until next year, though, correct? Yes, but it's winter of 1803. So it's going to happen the next turn, spring of 1804. He can play Hammett's army. And so. here's where I went all in. Oh, triply attack. Yes. That is an unusual move. Yes, yes. I thought, you know what, I'm going to try and catch him unawares here and see if I can't capture some frigates. Interesting, yeah. So Now, so just for next time, uh, because it's winter, uh, if he has uh, takes two hits and uh, damages the frigates, they have to come back next year, right? But next year is next turn because oh, so do this early it's winter. In the round is what you're saying. <clears throat> yeah, you want to. It would have been better to hold on and do that in the spring because then you push everything back to 1805. That's a right? really good point. That's a really yeah, good point. So, yeah. So okay. Um, but you never know. Like you're you're potentially going f to sink uh, a frigate, right? Which is so he which scored is good one hit, took out a, a courser. I yep, took two courser. hits. Now again, this is what I would have done for you: is I would have taken the hit on the frigate, and then it comes back in eighteen oh four next turn anyway. Right. Instead of losing the courser. Right. That yes. No, you're right. So that is okay. what so I. Okay. So another would have done. another good learning mo moment there. That's great. Yeah. All yeah. right, so we're at the beginning of uh, spring here, and uh, yes. he's got a discard. I've got a discard, I think. Yeah, interesting. So, yeah, so we'll you just yeah, skip so ahead here to work. Yeah, Sweden pays tribute would be good to hang on to because you can cancel his Swedish frigates if he ever gets around to playing them. Yes, you can cancel them right away. <laughs> um, and I so think I did. I did keep that one. Yeah, the U.S. Yep, here looks like you did, which is good. And, uh, yep, so what you discarded the US your cards. Here? Kept Treaty, uh, Constantinople. And he's got Burn the Philadelphia, Bainbridge. Also, he has this one that I can, <clears throat> I can have to pay back the, launch the... Pay back some, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And, and General Eaton attacks Dern is actually good because he, the, he can probably, uh, play Hammett's army into, uh, to get it on the board and then attack Dern shortly after. Right. Um, right, right, so that right. So that's uh, pretty good overall. Uh, General Eaton. Now, is this becoming yes. more more uh, more uh, important now? Yes. Yeah. Because yeah, that'll that'll be his. That's his move you know, into Dern, right? Rush. 
Yeah, if he wants to rush Dern, then that's the opportunity. And then uh, the and he can burn the Philadelphia and actually launch the Intrepid's good for him as well. If he because he can sink uh, your frigate and, and or some cor- and or a Corsair. So so yeah, he's got. Uh, I would say yeah, he's got a much better hand, hand this, this time round. Yeah, and so in, as far yeah. as mine goes, uh, pirate raid from the Algiers, which I have an action, so that's good. That's perfect. Uh, yeah, you may as well run the gauntlet there. That one's kind of the Morocco seems to be a dead card. Yes, Morocco's uh, shut uh, shut down, and so is Tunis actually. So uh, Sweden, are... the Sweden is a potential, like you were saying. Well, that's just held in reserve in case the Swedish uh, ships turn up. You can cancel them right away. Yes, yes. Uh, but what I would say is your strong play is to raid from Tripoli now because he's got no. There's no defenses up. And you have the um, the merchant ship converted, yes. which will give you an extra uh, Corsair as a re- reward. And you have Happy Hunting as well, which is uh, gives you an extra uh, three dice, three additional yeah. dice. Yeah. So I would say that would be your best move probably here. I, I believe, uh, but he's got he gets the first option. He gets the first move, though, yes. And I true. have a feeling he'll be looking to... Yeah. Um, He'll probably yeah. uh, Bainbridge. It looks like. Here. Oh, interesting. Okay. Take any so, card from America. So he draws a card pot. from the discard. And what did he pick? And, and plays it. Naval and he movement. Plays of naval course. movement. Okay. Yeah. So he's probably going to lock down Tripoli here. So but, he's moving right back into Tripoli. Yeah, that makes sense. And into and Dern. He's going to bombard uh, another bombard bombard Dern. Oh, he's bringing. Yeah. In the... He gets four dice and he misses. So uh, that's got to be frustrating because he's trying to get the. Uh, and I, I raided in Algiers. <laughs> nice. Took two more gold. You lost a Corsair, but you got a, a couple more gold. So he, yeah, the American player here is really under pressure. Four coins left. Yeah. And Hammett's army is nowhere close. And they just to... were created. So now they've started. Yeah. And uh, I am going for the pirate raid of Tripoli here. So Yes, very, very good. And he missed with all of it. So how much uh, did you come away with? Nothing. Oh, no see, now ships. that's where uh, I would have played happy hunting to get another three um, ships. Yeah. Uh, sorry, it's three rolls and, and um, the merchant ship. And the converted. merchant does merchant. Yeah. Merchant <clears throat> In the interface, dessert. you have to look up at the top. It'll say you can play such and such a card. Right. Uh, so. Um, and now it seems like a bit of a race against time. He's making the move as fast as he can. He needs to. And I am trying to steal gold as fast as I can. So we'll have to see yeah. how this uh, this shakes yeah. down here. Uh, he's going into dirt, and he took two. Yeah, now this becomes a battle to the death. This is attrition here now, eh, to the end? Okay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, one for one. He lost one. I lost one. Yeah. Okay. So you know what? You took two with two with you, and that, that Hemet's army is not that strong now. Well, uh, remember, especially if he's going to take Tripoli. Yeah, he's got to take Tripoli. So uh, if I were the American player, I'd be focusing on t- taking it Algiers. But then you uh, you played um, uh, the uh, Constantinople uh, S- uh, Sense 8. I, I thought, how could I not? You know what? He just which gives two frigates in Tripoli. So now you've really put the pressure on, which I, I really like. Yeah. Yeah, because... I, I just thought, you know what, I, I gotta, I gotta just spruce up a little bit more. I could have probably run in with without a head, but I thought I'm gonna, I'm gonna just bump it up. And because you've made it very hard for the U.S. to win by the treaty card, so they have to, the U.S. has to take Tripoli here in order to win, and that's a tall order. Look at that naval force Presence you have right there, now. yeah, and look at that army. So now he did play burn the be... Philadelphia, so we'll see. Yeah, because what... he's trying to, he's trying to get back. He's trying to. Claw oh, and he rolled a... And he failed. A one and a two, so that no good. Yeah, that was not good. Yeah, the game's definitely slipping away from the U.S. here. And uh, So your pirate rating and uh, misses entirely. Again, yeah. And Now I'm happy playing happy hunting. hunting. Perfect, perfect. And there's your gold. And there's my gold. Five, five ships captured, so... Great win. Yeah, yeah, it was... Uh, yeah. There was a, there was a few misplays due to, due to inexperience, um, but uh, overall you played a solid game. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, and it was a lot um, of fun, and I definitely even just talking through with you here has, has given me extra tips for for the next uh, for the next round. Yeah, so. for the next round. So yeah, yeah that I, I think this was a solid win for Tripoli for sure. Yeah, it was. It was, yeah, it was a lot of fun. You, so yeah, 
That's great. So thank you so much for watching. We hope you got some value out of this. Uh, if you want to uh, follow the tournament, we're going to post uh, the, the website uh, on uh, in the description down below. And uh, this interface, if you're curious, is, is called Rally the Troops, where you can sign up to play games like Shores of Tripoli. So, and we'll put a link uh, to that as well in the description. Absolutely will. So uh, please take a moment to like, comment, and subscribe. This has been... Legendary Tactics.